Hey, what's up? Welcome to another episode of We Bowling Over Here. Yes, sir. Uh huh. I'm going to talk about the Toronto Raptors today. The 2019 NBA champions, Toronto Raptors. We're going to discuss them, how they look in, what I'm seeing about them, what I like, what you know, what I think could improve. Just, just a little, my opinion, I would say. So, yeah, let's get into it. So, after three games now, Raptors sitting 2-1. and one. You know, not too bad. I mean, we're going to get into it game by game. So, let's not waste no time and get into the first game, the Pelicans, where the Raptors came out victorious. Yes, it went to overtime. I know, that was... But, you know what, to be honest with you, if I'm being honest, Pelicans should have probably won that game because we, we it was a fight till the end, yes. Um, they even won the fourth quarter um, in, in points. So, But it was a good game, and I would say um, our team came out strong. We had uh, came out heavy, and um, unfortunately, as we know, he did get fouled out, or he fouled out. Um, and about, what, like five minutes, I believe, to go if I'm correct, but sorry, yeah, um, that was the first game, so, yeah, it was a good game, as I said, um, Fred and, and, um, Pascal stepped up, um, guys like OG, he had a great defensive play on, um, uh, on, um, Drew Holiday, um, in the corner, and it was, it was just a really good game, so Raptors won, 130 to 122, you know, going into overtime, as I said, and, um, the game after that, now, the Boston Celtics, which was also another good game. It was like neck and neck. It was the whole game. It was just it was just neck and neck in a sense. But then the, the third quarter, a little separation. Fourth quarter, um, Boston kind of took their lead. But all in all, I mean, I, I believe Toronto had what it takes to beat them. Fred's shot was off. He wasn't shooting the best. He gave us um, eight points in 42 minutes. We had Kyle Lowry stepping up big. Kyle Lowry's been, like, amazing, you know, that I think that playoff or the NBA Finals, like, changed him as, like, a mental, mental person, like, mentally, mentally, it's changed his mind, like, how to approach a game, and he approaches it in a positive way, and he leads, and he leads with quality that people are willing to follow, and um, I'm like what I see from Kyle Lowry, so, 29 points in that game, Siakam came out strong again, gave us 33 you know, I'm liking Siakam get him. Oh, I'm sorry, not to disrespect, go, just go past it like that, but he banged a lot of threes, and I like that. that that's something I really like the improvement of. Um, the only thing is, I just, I guess he's got to get to a point where, you know, when you get to your spot, like you just catch the ball, that you know where you're going, just give me the ball right here. He hasn't established that yet. I mean, when he gets the opportunity and when he gets that moment, you see him shine in it, but he has to be more, I guess, dominant in finding his spot. Like, oh, give it to, on that right wing, on that left, what, that right there. Oh, you know, find that. Get there, do your thing. So, um, yeah, he's improved a lot. As I said, um, I'm liking what I'm seeing from him. So, see, I can keep doing your thing. You know, Kyle Lowry, keep doing your thing. Um, anybody see Mark Gasol? I ain't gonna lie, still he kind of MIA. Not gonna lie, but but season's early. Gotta give a lot of shout out to OG. Um, so yeah, Raptors did lose to the Celtics, uh, 112 to 106, which I mean, uh, we definitely should have won that game or could have won that game. So, but you're not gonna win all 82 of them. So hey, keep going. Now we bounce right back though. And came right in the next day, came at the Bulls and be like, what's up? Big boy them, championship them, let them know. Blew them out, stepped up, OG, dunking on everybody, blocking shots, OG. Pascal, a little lesser night, didn't have to, didn't play that much, you know, 19.6 rebounds, four assists. Um, I mentioned Pascal because, yes, I do believe he is our true star, our leader. And you know who's having a great season as well? Serge Ibaka. I've been seeing a lot from Serge. I just like his energy. He's he's more even fluid with his movements now. Like, he was, he's stiff, yes, but, like, pause, no, none of that stuff intended. But he's just, he's, he's doing a lot better, and I really like how um, Serge is just 
yeah, flourishing right now. So big up Serge Ibaka, having a great year so far. And um, as I said, we just need a little more from Mark Gasol. Uh, we have a game coming up tonight. Yes, recording this today. Uh, versus the Orlando Magics. So let's get it. You know, I'm rooting for the Raptors. I got to be honest, I'm very open. Yes, I support the NBA. But when you live in the championship city and you support your city, you got to support your team. Only makes sense. So thank you all for tuning in. I will be back with more updates, just talking along the, as the season go by. I'm going to try to make it more often, um, make more of these more often. And you know you know how it goes. We're balling over here, so we don't stop. You know what it is. Aha! We balling over here.